Hi everyone, welcome. My name is MJ and today I am inviting you to another spiritual journey tarot soul meetings where I discuss and explore different aspects of spirituality and spiritual growth. And as I have said in my previous uh, video, it actually turns out to be personal growth as well. So whatever is happening on that soul level then emanates on the outside and help us become better uh, in that outside world as well in whatever area of our life right and today i i want to continue with the self-love topic uh, i said previously that that this topic will stay with us for some time because there is just so much to be said about it and so much to explore and when i was preparing myself to do uh, this reading today i started with uh, the wisdom of the oracle and the botanical oracle cards to just like jump start uh, myself and when i was meditating these are the cards that showed up the first card is the treasure island from the wisdom of the oracle and the second one from the botanical is adventure treasure island and adventure uh, isn't this uh, a great combination of cards you know looking for a treasure island is definitely an adventure and it has been the topic of many movies and many books right uh, so let's review those cards the treasure island is is all about you know bringing dreams uh, into fruition uh, also with the use uh, of the law of attraction right uh, this is also about the results of our positive thinking that are made manifest. Uh, this is abundance appearing almost out of nowhere. Okay? And a good fortune. What it tells me is, you know, self-love is a treasure. And trying to find it is an adventure. So depending on how we look at uh, what is ahead of us if we look at things as obstacles we will be afraid and every path that we take will just bring fear into us if we perceive what is ahead of us as an adventure we are enthusiastic we have that childlike joy uh, of kids who create their own adventures and embark on them right and yes, self-love is a huge treasure. It's like hitting the jackpot as soon as we recognize how important, how valuable it is, and what great benefits it brings into our life as soon as we discover it. It's like a buried treasure that we are looking to find through our whole life, right? And we are the ones to recognize, you know, like if we had a map uh, of that treasure island and we were seeking for the treasure, there's always an X that marks the spot where the treasure is hidden, right? Now it is our responsibility and we are capable of recognizing where that X is, right? We do have the map. It is available to all of us. First, we need to learn how to read the map. And then, once we are capable of using the map, it's in, in our hands to follow the guidance, to find that hidden treasure, right? Now, when I say the map, it's all about the map of our soul, right? Uh, because that treasure of self-love is hidden within ourselves and we all have it but now we need to understand what self-love means to us how do we want to pursue it how do we perceive it you know everyone will see it in a little different way um, some people will be more focused on mind space on the way they think about themselves how they perceive themselves some will see self-love more related to their body how they uh, take care and nurture their physicality others 
will be more focused on your soul level happiness right obviously in the perfect world we should look at all mind body and soul because that that's the complete uh, whole and we can only thrive when we cover uh, all of those uh, levels of our being right but each and every one of us may want to start uh, from the different area right from the mind from the soul from the body okay so it's in our hands to learn how to read the map and then uh, use that guidance from the map to find that hidden treasure now what we need to do is trust our intuition as we go right because we all i said have the ability to read that map we just need to listen to the inner voice inner knowing that will be leading us um, it will also take hard work nothing comes easily in finding self-love finding that treasure is hard work too but if we look at it as adventure not as a hard task that we need to tackle but as an adventure then we will embark on that adventure with enthusiasm uh, with that childlike joy and we will just have fun you know self-love and finding ourselves can be fun it doesn't have to be and it shouldn't be a painful process uh, don't forget to enjoy that process don't forget to share your joy with others and remember that treasures multiply like magic so it may happen that we find that one treasure and it will be a beginning of a shower of treasures because the deeper we go in our self-love the more we will discover okay let's just top it up with some tarot cards I am really trying to keep those videos even shorter than previously. I, I want to try and close them within 10 minutes. Okay, this one wanted to fall, so let's see. The star, the guiding light. Okay, among its many meanings, healing, uh, dreams coming true, the star. Okay, first of all, the guiding light. I said we all have that innate inner wisdom. That if we just listen to our intuition and our inner knowing we will be able to use that map to read it and to find that hidden treasure okay so follow the guiding light and trust it don't question what it has to say because you know best how to read your map now it's also about dream coming true so finding that treasure island finding that true self-love is a dream come true and is that ultimate healing because only if we truly love ourselves we can heal our past wounds we can heal our past traumas or experiences that may have been painful and self-love is the ultimate healing tool okay so just to sum this up you know finding self-love is an adventure if we want to perceive it that way it's an adventure of exploring a treasure island in order to find that hidden treasure and if we only use our innate wisdom if you if we listen to our intuition at all times we will have the guiding light that will be guiding us step by step uh, to that x spot where the treasure is hidden and once we find it we will realize that this is the ultimate dream come true and the ultimate healing tool for all our hurts is our self-love and let me leave it here for today i hope that you enjoyed it and i hope that we will see each other again next time until then as always, please take care of yourself, your souls, your bodies, your mind spaces, and please love yourself. Bye.